So what do you do if your ripple is too high and your coherence is too low, you don't have enough signal to noise ratio? Um, well, the first thing you can try is to just turn up the averages. You see, that's why I have this set to infinite averages, so I'll just um, always have maximum averaging. Um, just remember to use the V key a lot, that'll reset the averages. Another thing you can try and do is reduce local noise. Um, I don't have a lot of control over that outside here. I just wait till the train goes by and then I start again. You can also increase your signal generator level. So I'll show you an example of that right now. I'll turn the measurement on and then I'll start to turn the signal generator up and see if I can see any improvement. All right, you can see that I turned the signal generator up significantly, but I didn't, I didn't see much improvement here in the measurement itself. So I can see that turning up the signal generator in the room doesn't help that much. I was already loud enough. So I'm gonna turn this back down to where it was. The other thing you can do to improve signal to noise ratio is to reduce the distance. So right now I'm at this gold distance of 3.25 meters, but I could go as close as 1.63 meters. And if I was inside, this is probably what I would have to do with this speaker if I was in a small or medium sized room to get the ripple low enough. In fact, I can show you an example of that because I was inside earlier today and this is the measurement that I, can, that I got. You can see a lot more ripple here in the low end um, because the room was not quite big enough. One more thing to try if you want to improve the ripple is to just change the orientation in the room. Ideally, you want to be somewhere with uh, you know close to the center of the room but not the exact center of the room and you don't want to be you know par parallel with any surfaces so i have done this before in a warehouse that's quite large but you have to sort of like you know move the entire thing around until you can find the position that delivers the lowest amount of ripple 